Hello everyone. <gasps> I could turn my ring light on. Ew. Okay guys, so tonight I'm doing what day is it? I think it's oh yeah, Tony's cousin day. It's the 24th of July. So before I was looking at stuff, uh, my clothes, and I wanted to do like a try on such and such with me. But then my battery was dead, so then I let it charge, and I was talking to Ari and stuff. And I was telling, telling her that I was going to do my teeth work. And then she was like, oh, you should vlog that. And I was like, well, okay. So what I'm doing right now, I'll put you guys somewhere. At TAFE, I am, we have to draw four outfits. So I did the green dress, and then before the blue dress, I'd done this. Which is kind of like one of the trendy outfits right now. It's a white shirt with the sweater vest and black wash, light wash, whatever, jeans, whatever they're called. But then I was like, you know what, I just want to do dresses. So then I, that's why these are cut out and glued on, if you can't tell. Because um, I had to restart. So we've got to do four outfits. I'm going to do four dresses. And then we have to pick one of them and draw a, like a big version. Front, back, and then two close-ups of it. So that is what I'm doing tonight. Oh my god. So my desk is in front of my window and I just saw the reflection on my hand and that scared me. This dress just came to me and this is something I copied from online and I'm really proud of it. I'm gonna do another like poofy one I think but then it might not fit. Cause even if I do two like short slim dresses I don't think it'll fit. Um, and we had to put like what fabrics we think will be good next to it hence why there are things coming out. But I think I want to do a red dress and maybe a yellow one. I feel like I'm being really loud. I just realized everyone's asleep. It's not, it's the weekend, it's Saturday and it's like 10 o'clock I think or 9.50 something and my whole family's asleep so I don't know. But if they wake up it's too bad. So I'm gonna look, no, I'm gonna try and do like something with a lot of like pieces on it and like red so i don't know if you guys can see though from here so if you can't then i'm sorry i've decided that i'm only going to do three on this paper and then i'll add a piece because if i restrict myself to a small dress then i might not like it and then i'll have to like cut it out and add another piece so i'm just gonna add a piece of paper later that folds out because i want these dresses to look good they might be in my fashion line in the future so remember that you might be the first to see them Okay, so the first one I did is a bit Tinkerbell inspired at the top. Actually, I don't know if that's what Tink is it that? I haven't seen Tinkerbell in a long time, but anyways, this is gonna be a red dress. And so the bit at the bottom, like the big part, that's gonna be like underneath with the fabric, and then the thin layer, like the outline, that's gonna be like organza or chul on top. I think that will look good. I meant for it to be poofier, but it just didn't work out that way, so it's fine. I like it still. And I don't know what fabric the main piece would be. Um, I'm thinking, like, the top, I want it to be really, not glittery, but, like, either, like, lace and sequins or, like, like, um, like, it's some fabric that's, like, got a little bit of glitter in it. I don't really know how to explain it, but, like, it's kind of like a little sparkle, but like not like not extreme, just like a little bit of glitter. I don't know. Does it look better with or without straps? Because I feel like with straps, it feels like you don't need the straps. But then without straps, I feel like there's something missing. Mm. Well, I already have a strapless, the blue one. And the green one is like a 
up to your neck one so I feel like the straps the thin straps are good here because it's like a different style so I'm gonna keep the straps I've never done this I don't think and I don't know if like fashion designers do this but I want to like name my dresses so this one her name is something like Veronica like something really that kind of like like yeah, Veronica, I think that's who it's like. This one is Christy, or Christina, because it just feels pristine, you know? It just, it's clean, it's, it just, it suits. Red one, I'm feeling Ramona. I think Ramona really goes with that dress. Please tell me there's a red. <gasps> there is a red. Orangey red, which is not really the red I wanted. What's this? Oh, it's a texture. I think I can use textures. We have a red crayon. I see something red. No, oh, it's just a regular pencil. It's actually really sharp, and I think I'll hold on to that. A little red pencil here. Oh, it's one of the airplane ones, but I guess it could still work. <gasps> wait, I'm like the dumbest person. Oh, wait, no. Actually, watercolor pencils. Right now, I don't really need them as watercolors, and they're the only pencils I can find. So, these will do. Somewhere in between a bright red and a maroon, kind of like this jumper. Yeah, that red. The way it shows up on camera. In real life, it's a bit darker. Even the real life version, I think, would be nice. But you're still a train. Oh, I think a mix between. Yeah, this is a bit RNG. Let me just try this one out. See which one I like more. So this one is the one on this side, I think. Yeah. So I'm gonna do the dark. I'm gonna do the darker red, which is this one, because it's not still not the red I really wanted. But I think I can just do a soft layer of this on top, and then it might look good. Hang on a sec. I'm like actually, there is something wrong with me. So, these watercolors are a bit unpleasant to color with, and I don't know if it's because they are meant for water or if it is because they've been wet before. But either way, but either way, they were not very satisfying to color with. I found these two reds. This one is also a watercolor. Oh, so is this one. This one's a bit more pink, but I'm gonna use both. This one is so soft. Like, it's so nice to color with this one. I like this one. Ooh, I like this one too. So guys, I'm starting to get tired. This is what the dress looks like. Um, So it's not bad, but it was like, it was taking that long because like, I don't know. I just never colored that much for that long. So I'm gonna go with Chul for the outside but that is what it is for now it's my least favorite so far like i i wouldn't wear that one but i think this is a better dress than this um so i think i'm gonna go to bed now but i'm gonna leave this out because i want to if i leave it out one of two things will happen i will either forget about it until next wednesday like literally like this on my bench on my bed on my desk it'll stay like that until next ugh, why is it so light It'll either stay like this until next Wednesday night and I'll be like, oh, I was supposed to finish that. Or I will be motivated enough to do it tomorrow morning. It'll probably be the first option, which I'm not happy about. But if I put it away, it'll be worse because then if I do remember to do it, I will have to take it out again. So I'm just going to leave it out. I'll do some tomorrow and yeah. I mean, literally all we did was draw a dress and color it. I don't know what I'm doing, but anyways. <laughs>